okay the last chemical calculation or stoichiometric calculation will be volume volume stoichiometric calculation so the question is how many liters in nitrogen dioxide are produced when 34 liter of oxygen react with an excess of nitrogen monoxide assume the condition are stp what is stp standard temperature and pressure okay boys by using this data we have to compile our data given or required so in data what is given volume of oxygen see this that when the 34 liter of oxygen so liter is a unit of volume so 34 liter of oxygen so what should i write volume of oxygen is equal to 34 liter of oxygen anything else nothing now next thing by getting the chemical equation you can get two moles of nitrogen dioxide okay give you one mole of oxygen the mole ratio of the balance equation from the balance equation we can get this and then one mole of oxygen is equal to 22.4 liter oxygen from where we get the 22.4 liter remember at stp the volume of one mole of any substance any gas especially will be 22.4 liter okay so what is it at stp this is the constant value okay at stp the volume of one mole of any gas will be 22.4 liter so 22.4 liter oxygen at stp as well as second equation uh, second guess is how many liter of nitrogen dioxide so nitrogen dioxide means no2 so one mole of no2 is equal to 22.4 liter because this is the gas as well so at stp one mole of nitrogen dioxide equal to 22.4 liter okay so what required the so volume of nitrogen dioxide in 34 liter of oxygen so let's proceed this is our chemical equation 2NO plus O2 arrow 2NO2 means 2 moles of nitrogen monoxide react with 1 mole of oxygen give you 2 moles of nitrogen dioxide. So, same strategy, conversion factor. What is it? What is given? 34 liter of oxygen from the question so liter of oxygen down and one mole of oxygen on the top okay so one mole of oxygen always equal at stp 22.4 liter times but you need it you need the no2 so moles of oxygen down and we required moles of no2 so this no2 basically uh, 2 moles of NO2 over 1 mole of oxygen comes from the this chemical equation which is mole ratio this is your mole ratio here okay so start again 2 moles of NO2 and how many oxygen 1 mole oxygen so 2 mole of NO2 over 1 mole of oxygen same thing we discussed this already so no need to discuss again here why I put here 2 moles of NO2 instead of 1 mole of oxygen like uh, why, I, why I didn't flip. So see here, moles of oxygen must be down mole of oxygen. That's why. Now, we don't need moles of nitrogen dioxide. We need volume of nitrogen dioxide. So moles of nitrogen dioxide down. And what we need is liter of nitrogen dioxide. Liter means volume. Okay. And one mole of any gas. Remember, STP 22.4 liter. So let's cancel the same units so liter of oxygen cancel liter of oxygen mole of oxygen cancel mole of oxygen mole of nitrogen dioxide cancel mole of nitrogen dioxide now what left 34 times 1 times 2 times 22.4 over 22.4 times 1 times 1 okay calculate it it gives you 68 liter and O2. 
now boys this is the official thing how we can can calculate it but i am going to give you the short key remember here 22.4 liter oxygen and 22.4 liter of nitrogen so you can cancel directly 24.4 and 22.4 22.4 here 22.4 here cancel out so no need to for the stp so what is given 34 so 34 times 2 directly okay over how many moles of anything divide by this then you can get it so this is only for the tip but it's better to go for the step by step wise like this what we did and i hope that you understood everything okay now the final one finding the volume of a gas needed for a reaction so the question is at stp how many milliliter of oxygen are needed to produce 20.4 milliliter so3 according to this balanced equation now by using this one thing is only given 20.4 milliliter of so3 so volume of sulfur trioxide which is so3 20.4 milliliter so 2 milliliter of sulfur trioxide or you can say 2 moles of sulfur trioxide give you 1 mole of oxygen okay the volume ratio of this balance equation for this so see this 2 moles times milliliter will be the same so 2 milliliter of sulfur trioxide react with 1 mole of or 1 milliliter of oxygen produce sulfur trioxide so what is required volume of oxygen so let's start now now let's start the solution 20.4 milliliter of sulfur trioxide from the question times 1 milliliter of oxygen over 2 milliliter of sulfur trioxide this is from the chemical equation so milliliter of sulfur trioxide cancel milliliter of sulfur trioxide after the calculation you can get 10.2 milliliter of oxygen now next question is methane burns in the air by the following reaction methane ch4 plus 2o2 arrow co2 plus 2h2o so what is the volume of the water vapor is to produce at stp by burning 501 grams of methane so what is given 501 gram so let's start directly i'm not putting here data but you need it okay so 501 grams of methane so grams of methane down and remember grams going to convert into the mole first so one moles of methane how, how much 16.05 grams of methane how you can get this this is molar mass of methane 16 now times moles of methane going down and what you need it water uh, water vapor here okay so this is your mole ratio so two moles of water over one mole of methane times you need the volume okay so one mole of water give you 22.4 liter of water now cancel each other grams of methane cancel gram of methane moles of methane cancel moles of methane moles of water cancel moles of water after that what left liter of water so volume of water vapor is this and calculating everything you can get the value 1.40 times 10 power 3 liter of water vapor thank you so much guys i hope uh, you enjoy the video